This is Alzheimer's. There are roughly 82,000 people died of Alzheimer's in 2011. 39,000 died of breast cancer. And to give you an example, there are 1,400 breast cancer foundations that raised $6 billion last year. There are six Alzheimer's foundations that raised $100 million last year. The numbers just do not, do not add up. Now meet my dad, John O. Ravitz, a.k.a. Johnny O. What you're going through right now with the Alzheimer's, as far as forgetting things and not being well, able I, to yeah, yeah, say I, what you really want to say, what does that feel like? Well, it's not... <laughs> It's, first of all, you have to figure out that once when that something is like that, the worst thing that I do, I know that I could go back up this way or down this way, and normally it's down more. So in other words, you have more time where you're not understanding or being able yeah, to yeah. say what you think than... That's right. than you're able to say it, and That's you have your right. good days and your bad days. That's right. But um, I don't know how long. I hope it's, you know, a while. That you'll be able to continue to remember yeah. Yeah. and take care of yourself and do the things you can do on your own. That's right. What, what is your fear about having Alzheimer's? You can talk and for a while, and then the next thing you're talking and you don't even know what's what. Right. Okay. You can't remember. You were a very intellectual person. I was. And now you have a hard time sometimes even telling me what time it is. It's, it, it's, it's something that uh, you... Some days you, you feel that uh, things are good and it's okay. Other times you figure from people that, uh, you know, don't even bother me. I, I've talked normally to people, but uh, that's the way it is. Someone asked me one time about what's going on with everything that's happened in the last seven years. It, you know, it, it's, 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 it's hard to describe, but it's totally draining. When you see a parent that you love deteriorate with this disease and the, and the strain and the tearing up of the family because of all the issues, it, it really hits home. Um, I think about this all the time. I mean, my life has changed. Our life has changed. Everybody's life has changed that's involved with us. And uh, I just pray that someday through all the, the work that people are doing towards research, I pray that someday they find a cure for these diseases.